Hey guys, it's Rainy Rodriguez, and you're watching Celeb Secrets for You. So you guys did four seasons of Austin Alley. Yes. Last dig, describe how that was for you. Sad. You know, it, it kind of didn't hit me yet until the end of the day. You know, you wake up like it's a normal day. You get up and you eat the breakfast and you go into hair and makeup. And, you know, you, it's a thing. And then slowly everything starts wrapping that day. Like, you know, we wrapped the music factory and that was it. And we wrapped, you know, the practice room and we wrapped the mall spot. And then we started wrapping our guest stars. And then, like, Ross and Laura wrapped. And me and Caleb were the last scene of the night. And we we're just like... This is it, you guys, this is it. Like, it's sad, it's sad for sure, but at the same time, happy and proud because we made such an amazing product that we're all so proud to be a part of. So happy that we've succeeded in everything that we wanted to do with the show, but sad that we wouldn't be doing the show anymore. <laughs> and then you guys are known as Squad Goals. Squad Goals. Um, what tips That's do you- awesome. yeah. I didn't actually know that. I don't know why I said it so confidently. Thank you. That's awesome, I love my squad. They're pretty cool. What tips do you have for friends to be like the best squad out there? Um, just like, have someone that each compliments each other. Like, I think that's awesome. Also, be your own person in the squad. Like, I'm known as, like, the mother of the group. I'm, like, the one that plans everyone's schedules and, like, plans the outings and the get-togethers. And I'll, like, make sure everyone's together and no one gets lost in the group. And everyone's healthy and everyone's good. So be, like, one person of, like, each squad. Have, like, a, have your own person, but at the same time, compliment each other, too. It's always important. And there's been a lot of talks about an Austin Alley movie. Would you be down to do one? And if so, what would you want it to be about? I would love to do an Austin and Alley movie. That would be another dream of mine. I would love it if we did like a world tour of some sort and we go like on tour to like Italy or Spain or like London or something and like a rock concert and then like, you know, something happens with the bus and like Trish books the wrong bus company and now they miss their bus and their flight and they have to figure out how to get back home or to the concert. That would be awesome. That's actually a good one. You should you should pitch I that. I should write that. Heath and Kevin. I just wrote the movie. And then you do do directing on the side. You've been in yes. movies. Um, what's next for you? Anything and everything. As an actor, you always want to keep working. That's your goal. I love to act. I love to sing and I love to direct. I love to write. I love to do all that stuff. So to be able to be creative in so many different outlets is a blessing. And to be able to be working, it's also a blessing. So anything and everything, I'm ready for it all. I want to try everything. Our last question, yes. what are you going to miss most about the cast? Just being with them every day. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to miss that. You know, you talk to them, you know, once every week or every other week, and you try to see them as much as you can. But really being with them every day, that's something that's truly special, and that's what I'll miss the most. Us, our laughter in between the takes and stuff. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start crying, so we got to end that. <laughs> and then we'll make it last happy question. It is Monday, Man Crush Monday. Oh, my God. Right now, Grant Gustin from The Flash. I'm in love with him. Um, also... Ryan Gosling, Darren Chris, Matthew Ray Goobler, Ed Sheeran, Bruno Mars, Justin Timberlake. I could go on. Any, any, hi. I'm currently unemployed right now, so if any of you are out there, I'm available. <laughs>